New information now on a story we brought you at 5 on Friday. Ted on your side has obtained the 911 calls placed moments after a Navy SEAL was hurt after base jumping from a Suffolk cell phone tower. A special warfare operator first class, Tyler Stimson, died in that incident. The 30-year-old was assigned to an East Coast-based SEAL team. Ted on your side's Kay Young is now here with more. Well, guys, Suffolk police say that Stimson and another SEAL, Jason Tomset, base jumped from the tower early Friday morning. Tomset called 911 as he held his friend after the accident. Chopper 10 was above the scene as rescue crews responded to a base jumping accident. Navy SEAL Jason Thompson called for help. A jumper fell. A jumper fell? Where was he jumping from? Yep, he's, uh... He's jumping from a tower. His breath heavy, but his voice even. Tom Set tried to tell a Suffolk dispatcher where they were. While he explained the tower was near routes 10 and 32, he also tried to help his friend, a fellow SEAL, Tyler Stimson. H how did you all get there? Uh, for what road? Uh, uh, so what? Then the call disconnected. The dispatcher called back. Oh. And Tom said explained the tower was close to Harold Drive. The dispatcher tried to get information about Stimson's condition. What kind of injuries did he, how far did he fall, sir? I don't know yet, but uh, I want to attend to him uh, if I can. And uh, I just want to get the call in for right now. The 30-year-old Stimson did not survive the base jump. Investigators say his parachute did open, but it's not clear if it ever opened fully. Now, Suffolk police did charge Tom Set with trespassing in the case. Stimson served as a SEAL supporting operations in Afghanistan and Iraq. Funeral arrangements are still pending. And Kay Young, 10 on your side.